What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, hope you're all doing well. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to like, share and subscribe, it does help the channel out. I just made $8,000 off Ethereum Max. Or did I? Let's get straight into it. Alright guys, today we're talking about Ethereum Max, getting a lot of controversy over the last couple of days. It is connected to Fly Money, Mayweather and Logan Paul fight. So we'll jump straight into their website. So what is Ethereum Max guys? Ethereum Max is a decentralized ERC20 grow token built on the secure Ethereum network. Now don't get this wrong, it is built on the Ethereum network but it's not connected to Ethereum coin 1 and 2 at all so it's a different cryptocurrency altogether we'll scroll down a bit ethereum max is a decentralized coin so it's self-sufficient that gives card holders the control of their own assets it is a secure coin on the secure ethereum blockchain ledger all emax tokens were released on an open and fair market for all holders emax is also an efficient and eco-friendly coin now this is a big one for cryptocurrencies as we see with elon musk and tesla not using bitcoin as a form of payment anymore as it uses too much energy and defeats the purpose of them making electric cars so Having cryptocurrencies that are eco-friendly is a big thing around cryptocurrencies right now. Two quadrillion total supply of Emacs with a market cap of 360 million. Now that is a pretty small market cap in relation to all other cryptocurrencies. Now the reason for that, this cryptocurrency was only produced, made two days ago. So Ethereum Max recently just went through a hard fall. Now a hard fall is a split in the token forming a completely new token. So Ethereum Max split into a completely new token. Now both the Ethereum Max previously and the Ethereum Max that just me made two days ago are falling under the same name. Now this is where a lot of the confusion is coming from. So the only thing that distinguishes both of them is the code of the wallet. Only today it jumped 19,000%. So it is making moves. So we checked the one one chart, you can see in May 17th. So this is when Ethereum Max, the first one was produced. And then you can see it fell off to zero. So this is when the split in the token formed a new token. Check the 24 hour, you can see it's up 19,000%. So it, that is a massive jump. Now, because this cryptocurrency is so new, and it's just been made two days ago, it is not available or tradable on most currency exchanges, such as Coinbase, Binance, Crypto.com, Wirex. So I bought it on an app called Metatask. Now Metatask is a software cryptocurrency wallet which is used to interact with the Ethereum blockchain. So I deposited $100, converted it into Ethereum and then converted it into Ethereum Max. So that gave me 1.7 billion Ethereum Max tokens now. Now where the controversies come from is the amount of money people think they've made. So we'll move on to coin market cap. We'll insert how much coins we have and that gives me a total of 8,182 US dollars. So there's me thinking I'm happy as Larry. Oh, I made $8,000 one day, that's great. No, this is off the previous Ethereum Max coin. So this is not Ethereum Max that I just bought that was produced two days ago. So this is where a lot of the controversy is coming from. People think they've made thousands, but unfortunately, that's not the case. Even though we're wrong on the amount of money we made with Ethereum Max, Ethereum Max is still on the rise. Now we need to talk about why it's going on the rise. So one aspect of this is the controversy with the Logan Paul and Mayweather fight. As you can see, Mayweather versus Logan Paul on June 6th, 2021, now accepting Ethereum Max for credit sales. Now this is causing the controversy and the price increase. So if we go over to Twitter, a lot of people are giving out. You can see here, there's three different Ethereum Max already set up probably all scams. Someone makes sense of this, hashtag Emacs, why does Uni say 900 while Trust Wallet says 52K? So like I just said, the 52K is coming from the previous Ethereum Max coin. So he bought the new Ethereum Max coin. Trust Wallet is recognizing it as Ethereum one. So we scroll down to Ethereum Max. Now this Ethereum Max account, it probably is a fucking spam account. So there's no blue tick beside it or anything like this. So it's posting this poster, Mayweather versus Logan Paul, June 6th now except in ethereum and ticket sales so this is where the controversies come from and probably the price increase of ethereum max so check a few replies you can see this is not us it's not real for your safety please do not engage with them so it is looking pretty dodgy with that another article counteracts this saying and after further investigation we've determined that mayweather paul tickets.com will be offering tickets to the event at hard rock stadium and will be accepting ethereum max as a form payment now let's go into their profile what is this shit like 1,420 followers, like, that's not fan me all, like. We'll head over to Instagram, we'll have a look at Logan Paul's account. As you can see, he's not on a story. In his most recent promotion, you can see there's no talks of Ethereum Max on this at all. So definitely this is a scam. Someone set up an account on Twitter, Ethereum Max account on Twitter, stating they are accepting Ethereum Max for the Floyd Mayweather and Logan Paul fight, which they are not. So you're gonna send all your Ethereum Max 
that you've bought and you're going to send it to a wallet and you're thinking you're going to pay for the fight when then your Ethereum Max coin is gone. To say that the coin is a scam, the coin is not a scam. It is a good quality, actually good quality coin, an eco-friendly coin. So guys, definitely don't pay for the fight with your Ethereum coin as you will lose it completely. So yeah guys, that is pretty much it. Let me know in the comments below if you thought you made thousands on this cryptocurrency. At the end of the day, it is a good cryptocurrency. It is a decentralized currency. It is secure on the Ethereum blockchain and is eco-friendly. On the other hand, the controversy about the Mayweather fight and Logan Paul fight is a lot of bullshit. So don't be spending your Ethereum plus on this fight. So let me know in the comments below what you think about this cryptocurrency. Is it a scam? Do you like it? Also guys, I want to mention my Patreon. We cover weekly stock watches and exclusive content. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and check the link in the description. And with that said guys, I will see you in the next one. Peace.